This is a video tour of a uh, two bedroom Finca style villa, only about 10 minutes drive to the village of Competer. We're just looking at the access to it now. Um, so we're going to have a look. It's kind of located on a bit of a ridge, so the views are fantastic both sides. You can see you've got plenty of parking space. This is room for a couple of cars. A little bit of a uh, garden storage there just behind. We're just going to take the steps here, which takes us up to this uh, gorgeous villa. Breathtaking views as we'll see shortly. We're filming this at uh, the end of February, middle end of February. Beautiful day but there's pools covered up but if you look on the listing there are shots of it open. But you can see first of all, got a fantastic location for the pool. We just walk around the terrace surrounding if we just have a look over the edge. There you can see absolutely fantastic views of the mountains, the local countryside. Just walk to the end of the pool terrace. We just pan around. It's a bit hazy today, so you can't see, but pretty much in the middle of the shot now, there are views of the sea. We just pan back round. There you can see the pool and you can see the the property in the distance with a small storage casita. You've got space here for sun loungers. So if we just have a walk towards the villa itself. That's the, the, start, the steps that we came up onto it. First of all, the outside space here, you've got a really large area. You've got an outside kitchen there, you can see in the distance with a brick built barbecue. We look back again, you can see the stunning views that we can enjoy from here across the pool. Have a look at the small casita first. Just storage ready at the moment, so it's not looking its best, but it is a good space for outside garden furniture and bits and pieces. And if we go walk through the casita, we'll just have a, look, a quick look at the land that comes with the property. It's almost like a secret garden, really. See how it extends up there. And you can see down below, we'll just have a little wander down. There you can see a nice orange tree there in the distance. Got the almond blossom out at the moment, which is beautiful. And you can see there where the kind of like the bamboo is, that's the limit of the land. So if we go back up to the outside of the property. Walking across again the large terrace area. There's an entranceway to the kitchen there, but we're going to have a look and fire the front door. You've got more terracing here, as you can see. More seating, chill out seating here, just outside the front door. You've got a table and chairs that you can put out under this partially covered terrace. And once again, if we get to the far end, you can see there in the distance, stunning views, cracking sea views on a clear day. So it's a bit hazy, so it's a little bit difficult to see. So first of all, if we enter through the main door or into this large living come dining room, you can see here it's got the rustic beams which gives it that kind of traditional Spanish finca feel. Got a focal point there of the uh, wood burner. Plenty of space in here as you can see for two two-seater sofas, coffee table, you've got a TV cabinet as well. We just come from the far side and pan around. There you can see the front door there where we just come in. Again, you've got a dining table and chairs, you've got space for that. And there we have the, the fireplace. So immediately off the living dining room, we're into this very traditional Spanish style kitchen with tiled work surfaces like a marble effect, double sink. What was the old uh, fireplace there has been turned into a bit of wine storage. And you 
you've got space here for you've got an electric hob, you've got space for a fridge freezer. And you've got an electric oven there, you can see more storage underneath. It's a very traditional sort of shelving that you find in the traditional Spanish finca. That's the doorway out to the terrace that we looked at earlier. Just have a quick look again. Can't get bored of those views in the distance. Then if we come back to the living room briefly, immediately off here, there's the uh, the main bedroom. Good size double bedroom as you can see there. Size for uh, space for a king size bed, quite easily in bedside cabinets. Windows overlooking the terrace. And then we've got, uh, we've got the traditional curtain covered storage space or cupboard space. There we go, we're looking the, uh, the outside. Then if we continue off the principal bedroom, walk through into the ensuite shower room. There you can see there's a walk-in shower. You have a hand basin and a WC and then you've still got plenty of space there for floor storage. Got a heated towel rail in here also. So if we exit the ensuite, briefly back into the main bedroom again. And again, just running off the living area, we have a bathroom again, second bathroom, nicely tiled again, traditional kind of rustic style tiles. You've got a shower over the bath. Would be quite nice to take the bath out, perhaps on a large walking shower. You've got a Nice little bowling set hand basin there with the WC around the corner. And then we're back out of this bathroom or into the second bedroom. Again, not a bad size, smaller than the first, obviously. Just about space in here for a double bedroom. We've got a sofa bed in here at the moment. Got a window there providing natural light. Just pan round. You can see there's a bedside table there already, but you could get a double bed in here. Got some cupboard space again behind the curtains. Air conditioning as well. So just have a walk through one last time by the uh, the living room. So here we are. It's a two bedroom, two bathroom sort of Finca style villa. Very very traditional. Superb location on this ridge, which gives. Um, views to the countryside as we can see here uh, if you'd like to arrange a viewing of the property please get in contact I'd love to show you around there's more details on the actual listing itself and more photographs with the pool uncovered so please give us a call